backyard today, standing in an older home from about the mid 1900s. And I thought this was the perfect opportunity to show you the power of frost. So this is a basement that's about four to five feet below grade outside. Um, there's no insulation on the foundation wall, no insulation under the concrete floor in the basement. And this basement has been unheated for a couple years now. And you can see here on the floor that there's all these great big cracks and that the floor is sloping towards the foundation. The automatic assumption would be the foundation's sinking, but that's actually not the case. It is that the floor is heaving. And I can show you here by this board how much of a gap we're talking about. So we got like three to four inches this floor has lifted due to frost. Go to this next level, you'd see how the, the walls are all cracked, the floor is heaving. What's happening is, it's basically that this house is unheated, so the cold, this concrete floor has gotten cold, the soil below it has started to expand due to the frost. And it just shows there's probably a lot of moisture in this soil, soil so it's lifting a lot. In our newer homes today that we're building, we put a rock layer of about eight inches thick under this, so rock doesn't expand or contract. So that helps to prevent that. Plus it takes the moisture away from the floor, but also we add four inches of continuous insulation under floors like this. And these walls would have solid insulation on it. But all, even if your basement was unheated, there's still a lot of protection there preventing frost from getting under that floor. Um, but ultimately, you should heat your basement. Same with garages. They should be heated because it hurts the structure if you don't.